Hi, I'm Jeff Stokes. Welcome to Jeff's Daily Dose of Encouragement. Today, I'm going to encourage you with a little bit of wisdom from Proverbs 22. In verse 3, and it says, A prudent man foresees evil and hides himself, but the simple pass on and are punished. Or, I think in the NIV it says, A prudent man foresees danger and takes refuge. And the word simple in there, it's it like means it means silly or seducible, you know, um, maybe the word gullible might come into it. So what's going on here is that it's saying that the that when we know there's danger ahead, we take precautions, we take action to try and avoid it. But the but a foolish person or a simple person will just keep going and walk straight into it and suffer the consequences. And so I've often pondered on that scripture over over the years and, uh, and and there's many times I've thought, oh, don't want to go there. And I make sure I'm, I'm in another place that, that's not going to uh, compromise my safety. So it's just a little bit of wisdom but it, it's a some people are very bullish and say oh I'm, I'm not afraid of that I'm just going to go anyway and that's fine but it might be wise sometimes you know they say that discretion is the better part of valor uh, and sometimes we need to really just be wise about just bowling on ahead in danger I mean what a good example is people that <coughs> get for instance travel warnings before they travel you know from their government to say <clears throat> don't go to this country it's it's recommended you don't go to this country because <clears throat> it's a danger zone you, you you could be in danger you could lose your life or whatever and people decide to travel anyway and next minute they get incarcerated or caught up in some civil war that's going on or something and then can't get out and um, that's that's a perfect example but there's lots of situations in life where we could be wiser instead of being silly and just and just marching on um, it's, it's not just talking about physical situations getting getting into or going to but also maybe doing deals that that we should avoid doing or buying things we shouldn't buy even uh, that, that might that might be we might be compromising ourselves or putting ourselves in, in a situation of danger or compromise <clears throat> that we best avoid. Anyway, that's my encouragement for you today from Proverbs 22 verse 3. If you don't know the Lord Jesus Christ, the Bible says he is wisdom personified. If you confess with your mouth the Lord Jesus and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you will be saved. For whosoever shall confess that Jesus is the Son of God, God dwells in him and he and God. And then you can have your personal guide, your personal wisdom from the, from, from the Holy Spirit who Jesus promised to, would be sent. And he will guide you into all truth. He will warn you of things to come and keep you safe. God bless you. Have a great day.